Oh, hey everybody, just here to show you my super awesome zombie mill deck. Now, first, you want three soul bone towers. Basically, these are the cards that send uh, the top two cards of your opponent's uh, deck to the graveyard. So, you want three of those bad boys, you know, to stack. Alright, next, you want your goblin zombie, which its special ability allows you to add one card from your deck. Um, one zombie card from your deck to the graveyard as long as it has 1200 defense or less and usually you want to get zombie master basically specials uh, zombies from the grave so you can activate that bone tower effect next you want that morphine jar which uh, basically when it's flip summoned you know you discard your whole hand both of you guys not just you and you get a uh, fresh new hand you know next you want this guy this guy has a great special ability that it, can't be destroyed by battle, and if it lands a direct hit on your opponent, he discards uh, one random card from his hand. So yeah, you're just murdering his uh, whole deck. Next, you want your Plague Spreader. Basically, you could special summon it by placing one card from your hand on the top of your deck. Then, plus he's a tuner, so you can synchro into better, awesome, more powerful cards. Next, you want your Mizuki, which his effect allows you to, when he's in the graveyard, he can remove himself from the game for good to special summon any zombie type monster. So, you know, bring out this bad boy, little blood over here. You know, basically for kicks, you know, basically able to, uh, you know, 2100 attacking. You know, he could, his ability is uh, when uh, he's, uh, what's it called? When he's normal summoned again, he could special summon a zombie monster from the graveyard. But if he leaves the field, he uh, takes all of them with him, so yeah, it's pretty risky this one. And next, you want your pyramid turtle. Basically, when it's destroyed by battle, um, it's sent to the graveyard. So if he's uh, removed, the effect doesn't go, which is kind of sad. He is able to special summon one monster with 2,000 or less defense, which is basically limitless because you know. Hardly any zombie monsters are packing up that defense. They're mostly attacking monsters. Next, I like to do the combo with the one dead piece where ne neither opponents take battle damage, which is pretty sweet. You know, so you're pretty safe for one turn. Alright, next, you want your Gravekeeper Servant. Basically, if you have three of these, he has to send the top one top card from his deck to the graveyard. Man, we just taking away all his cards, man. He's going to regret um, running that 40 cards. He's going to wish he ran that 60 card deck. Next you want your upstart. Uh, your opponent gains a thousand life points, but you know, what the heck. Next you want your lure of darkness, then you draw two cards. Man, this is bad boy. Alright, but you have to remove from play one dark monster from your hand. You know, a little drawback can't be too broken. Next you want your zombie world which actually helps the bone towers effect because it uh, makes all zombies in the graveyard like also zombies so if they were to bring their monsters back from the grave bone towers effect would activate and they would essentially mill more cards. Fantastic you know. Next you want your book of life. Now this guy's ability is like really good. Not only do you get to special summon a zombie monster you get to take out one of his monsters from his graveyard and totally remove it from the game foolish basically for plague spreader or mizuki so, you know your dark world dealings oh yeah the deck list will be in the description so if you don't want to watch this video i'd understand just look at the description dark hole destroys freaking annihilates every monster on the field book of moon you know stops an ability from activating and you call the haunted basically for like uh you know special summoning obviously and for a uh, goblin zombie you know to activate his effect it it activates even if it, this card is a mystical space typhoon or you know destroyed by any other cards so that, uh, that's pretty much it see ya